It's the day before Thanksgiving, and I'm hunting in Montana with my good friend Mike Watkins at Trophies Plus Outfitters. As you can see, conditions are ideal. It's cold, there's an inch of fresh snow on the ground, and the whitetail bucks are in full rut. We see deer activity literally every second during the first couple of hours. There he is. You see him there? I just ran this other buck off and he I came out and he'll... No. Okay, he's right back by the door. That's a different one. That's a different one. He's standing back in the woods, Lance. Just looking around now. See him? He's walking away. And at the end of our morning sit, Cameraman Lance Tangen and I see this monster buck chasing a doe some 500 yards away. He may run her right back out in this open. But that's as close as he gets. Well, we just finished our first sit here in Montana hunting with my buddy Mike Watkins from Trophy Plus Outfitters. Here got the new TC icon, it's gun season. We saw a tremendous amount of, amount of deer activity this morning, buck activity, whitetail bucks. And uh, we're gonna meet our guide. We didn't wanna do our wrap, wrap up at the blind, at the ground blind where we hunted. We were in a box blind, actually we sat outside it this morning and I don't know how many bucks we saw, 12, 14, 16. Um, saw some big, big bucks, but they were all out of range. Saw a bunch of two and a half year olds within range, but you know we're looking for something bigger. And uh, we're going to meet our guide, Tom Baker, about a quarter of a mile here. We've got to walk out. And Tom told us when we leave the blind, make sure that we sneak hunt our way back out to where we're going to meet him because there's a lot of deer activity in between where we hunted this morning and where we're going to meet Tom. So first day, first morning is, well, it's not really over. We're going to sneak hunt our way out of here, but stay tuned. we still got a good afternoon. And we got a little bit of snow on the ground. Temperatures are cold, and the whitetail bucks are rocking here in Montana. Lance and I slowly make our way along the edge of the thick cover that borders these hay fields. It's our hope that we'll catch a big buck out in the open. We just walked up on a, on a big buck. He was rubbing his antlers right there on the edge of those, those willows right there on the edge of the field, like a 7,500 yards in front of us. I can hear him in there. I can hear him grunting and smashing brush. He's right there. I kid you not, we walked right up on this big buck. I saw him and I, I can still hear him in there. Let's get up here, maybe he'll come back out. in those willows. I'm just going to sneak up ahead here, get set up on the bog pot, see if I can, see if he'll come back out. He's over here. He's rubbing on the brush right there. You want him? I'm on him. Oh, 
There he goes. He's hit. He's hit good. There he goes. He's down. Yes, Montana Whitetail. Trophies Plus Outfitters, Mike Watkins. We're a winning combination. Whew. Sneaking back to, to meet our guide, Tom Baker. First morning of the hunt, and we watch, we see this big buck rubbing his antlers on these willows. He walks into the willows, so we sneak in there a little closer, get set up. He walks back out and starts rubbing his antlers again. Now we're going to go take a look at him. Come on along. There's a major, major sign here after the hit. Shooting at 30 TC in that new TC icon, Thompson Center icon. 30 TC caliber. Well, I saw him go down. I can't wait to get my hands on him though, because he's a great deer. What a great, oh, I can see antlers from here. Look at this deer. Look at the size of this whitetail. See the body on this thing. Great, great. Montana whitetail. Look at this. That 30 TC. How's that for a deer? Right there. Montana, Southeast Montana with my good friend Mike Watkins, Trophies Plus Outfitter, guide Tom Baker. Lucky Tom. Did it again first morning of our hunt. Tom told us to do a little sneaking on the way back to where we were supposed to meet him after we got done hunting at a, at a ground line. And look what we walked up on rubbing his antlers on some willows. Basic 5x4 with a sticker. Unbelievable. He maybe made it 50, 60 yards after the hit. What a great deer.